the AIPM's been around for just over 60 years and it comes from a discussion in the 1950s between all the police commissioners that was initiated by their then head of the Commonwealth Investigative Service, a guy called Ray Whitrod. And the Commonwealth Investigative Service was the forerunner of the AFP. And he said to the other commissioners, I think we really need a place to hold and home the development of our senior leaders for policing right across Australia. And the federal government gave us a great piece of land at Manly to home the Institute at. The AIPM's role is to develop senior police executives, but also work with senior public safety executives from emergency services, other law enforcement agencies, intelligence agencies, public safety agencies, to help them to be the best they can to lead our organisations, both now and into the future. One of the things that makes the AIPM unique is our ability to bring people together from a range of different organisations across Australia uh, and internationally to come together and share their experiences across the law enforcement, police and public safety environment. The AIPM as a, as a premises or a location or a place of you know, education uh, is a perfect setting. It's, it's stuck within the middle of Sydney but it could be a million miles from anywhere else. You know, what we try and do is get people to try and free themselves of distraction, which is a really important piece of the AIPM experience. You know, it gives you that capacity to, to sort of have some spare time to reflect, to walk in the natural surroundings that we have, the bush, the beach. There's a whole range of, of opportunities for people to actually take some time, take a deep breath and, and reflect on what's going on and what's important uh, and how that affects their learning and, and, and contributes to their own growth. I think one of the beautiful things about this place is that you're forever a member of the AIPM family. So we see people come back throughout their careers um, as they've progressed through their organisations as they're facing new challenges. Um, and so the AIPM, the library, the networks that we have and the friends that you make when you are here stay with you throughout your career and that's a really important part of being part of the AIPM. So the program we've got running at the moment is our Graduate Certificate Program. So that's a four module program, two of which are delivered here residentially, um, allowing people again from around the world to come together to complete uh, a rigorous academic qualification in applied management. Um, we have people drawn from organisational psychology backgrounds, from economics, from criminology, from social sciences, from business, from management. So, the Grad Cert is a truly interdisciplinary experience uh, because the work that we do is truly interdisciplinary. And we really are uh, the profession's AIPM. So when people come here, we like to remind them that we are part of them and they are part of us. We are your AIPM. What we've done in this program is tried to provide an opportunity where people can make sense or understand what's going on in their contemporary organisations. Because that change creates a lot of tension a lot of conflict, a lot of angst, and in this program they have an opportunity of exploring why those tensions are being created and, and to look to see where the opportunities of taking um, their organisations and their people uh, forward. I like to think that if we are developing people uh, for complex environments, we have to give them the time and the space for them to understand, try and make sense of what's going on, but most importantly to share that experience and that insight with other people and try and make sense of it. And throughout this program what we've tried to do is build in time and space for them to share with those others in order to create new learning. AIPM offers a really unique learning environment for executives in policing and in other justice clusters and emergency services in that it creates a safe, nurturing environment where it encourages critical thinking. It encourages critical thinking outside your own agency where you're not being judged. So you can question the way that we've always done things. Um, it exposes you to different ideas and different concepts. Um, and then also allows you to work with a, a network of people who are facing similar challenges.